A disturbing trend continues here in Baltimore. Another child shot over the weekend, this time a nine-year-old girl. WJZ is live at the crime scene in Waverly. Tracy Leong has the latest in the search for the gunman. Trace? Good afternoon, Jess. Well, the gunman opened fire in this neighborhood. He was aiming for four young men. Police say he missed his targets, instead striking that nine-year-old child. Outrage in this Waverly neighborhood. Another child falls victim to a senseless shooting. It could be either one of our children. These babies belong to us. The Bible says it takes a village to raise them. Where's the village? Parents fearing for their children's safety after a nine-year-old girl is shot in the leg while playing on her porch. This is not okay. This should not be normal. Uh, only the scum of the earth would do this to a nine-year-old child. Baltimore's leader standing with the police and the community demanding the violence to end in our city. The irony of being so close to Mackenzie Elliott's um, crime scene and, and her tragic death, um, you know, maybe this is a time to get this one right. If we didn't get that one right, let's get this one right. Three-year-old Mackenzie Elliott was murdered in a drive-by shooting last August while playing in front of her home. Police still searching for Elliott's gunman who was killed just a block away from where the child was shot. Another juvenile, nine years old, uh, who has been shot in the crossfire. I renew my request to the community to come forward with information. Police still searching for that gunman. They have not released a description, but they're also looking for those four young men he was targeting. They have been described as young African American men. Reporting live, Trace Leong, WJZ Eyewitness News. Tracy, thank you. The nine year old girl is in stable condition.